po tayo ngayon sa Archive. It's a sneaker store and they also have a coffee shop. Tapos iba-ibang mga streetwear pa rin na makikita rito. And I'm with the owners, si uh, Maki, si Mark, and si E.G. So guys, we're going to pick five winners. All you have to do is listen carefully dun sa ating discussion ngayon because we're going to ask three questions. At pag nasagot nyo yun, i-post nyo yung comments nyo and then we'll pick the winners through random pick. Okay? Good luck. Oh, what, oh, what, oh, what, oh, what, oh, what, oh, what, oh, Julius Babao, unplugged. Julius Babao, Julius, Julius Babao, unplugged. Oh, what, oh, what, oh, what, oh, what, oh, what, oh, Julius Babao, unplugged. Oh, tell us about uh, the OG Steer. Uh, what's the oldest that you have here? Um, so the shoes you see. They're all 1985 Air wow. Jordan ones. It's uh -oh. the first uh, issued Jordan ones. Mm -hmm. So hindi siya yung retro na nakita natin sa matindahan, but uh -oh. it's all original. So literally OG talaga OG original. 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 Uh, first release. First release. First release. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Ano ito mga to? Describe natin sa mga uh, viewers so, natin. We start with the Jordan One Black Toes. Okay. So it's parang uh, a mixture of Chicago's and Breads. Mm -hmm. Itong Black hmm. Toast Jordan 1 OG na to, 1985 pair. Uh -oh. um, for collectors, this is a holy grail. Uh -oh. Considered as a holy grail yeah. pair uh -oh. sa mga OG collectors. Since uh -oh. sobrang hirap talaga niya hanapin. Uh -oh. um, like kami, it took us a lot of years para uh -oh. ma-acquire ma ma namin itong pair na to. Uh -oh. Then this one is also a Black Toast 85 mm -hmm. but in size 6.5 size. Uh -oh. Ang mga size 6.5 and below kasi na Jordan 1s, mm -hmm. makikita mo is nakalagay, hindi siya Air Jordan, uh -huh. but it's, ang stamping niya is Sky, Sky uh -huh. Jordan. Sky Jordan. But this one, uh -huh. it's Air Jordan. So, people tell us, and kami rin, never pa kami naka-encounter ng below, size 7 below na Air Jordan. Uh -huh. It's usually talaga yung, na sinasabi namin, it's Sky Jordan. But uh -huh. this one, it's an Air Jordan stamp. You go below 6 Below 7, ang stamp niya sa, sa, ng Air Jordan is Sky Jordan. So parang sabi nila, oh. and kami na rin, it's a unicorn pair. Kasi we've, yeah. we've never seen any 6.5 pair ng 85 na Air Jordan na stamp. Pero among all the the ones, ang talagang pinaka-original, among all of these. Ito yung sinasabi na na band pair where he is fined oh. 5,000 US dollars per game. On September 15th, Nike created a revolutionary new basketball shoe. On October 18th, the NBA threw them out of the game. Fortunately, the NBA can't stop you from wearing them. Air Jordans from Nike. The reason why they banned the black and red pair is that it's an NBA. Uh, you're only allowed to wear white shoes. Yeah. Before, no? Before. Uh -huh. So Jordan wore this and the financial $5,000 per game. Per game. That's oh. why we came out with this one. With the oh, white, white, red. Oh. white and red. This came first and then it all. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In the same year, same 1985. Same, same year. year. Then follow up the uh -oh. Carolinas, Royals, uh -oh. and Black Hills. Carolina is where he went to college. Carolina University, University of North, North Carolina. Carolina. Yeah. In color in uh, So that's the reason why I put it in the release of color uh, uh, to the commemorative in college. Yeah. Uh. So this uh, color uh, wasn't so famous before until now, the Sababu generation, because of this, the off white uh, Virgil Ablo collab in UNC. Now, dahil famous na lang ito, Pag nakita mo to, very familiar na, di ba? Parang baliktad, no? Uh, mas nakikilala ng bagong generation yung ganitong color because of this. And now, pag nakita mo to, ah! Doon pala nang galing! Actually, nung lumabas itong mga UNC off-whites, uh, doon tumaas yung mga presyo ng mga original colorway uh, na UNC ones. Uh, Even yung retros nito, uh, nagsitaasan. Uh, so before, stable yung prices ng mga retro UNCs, but uh, when this came out, uh, I shoot up yung mga prayer. Iyan ang may kasalanan. Bakit tumaas? 
Oh, 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 what about this? Ano naman ang story nito? Ah, uh, tung Royals naman. Mm -hmm. Ikaw mo spin. I mean, Royals. Royals. Royals just ano, another colorway lang na nilis nila. Ah. Uh -huh. Um, hindi ko lang kung nakakanda niya sa photo shoot niya. Ah. Uh -huh. Yung jump shoot niya. Na, uh, blue and world. Ah, uh, blue. Royal blue cha black na uh -huh. jump suit. Ah. Uh -huh. Tingin sa niya din sa photo shoot niya. Just another colorway. Nothing um, uh -huh. specific to any. And he wore all of this uh, actual game. No, uh, hindi. Ito, um, of course, hindi niya ito si Nosa. Hindi niya si Nosa. Um, first, ito yung snow niya. Uh, the rest. He got banned from uh, NBA. Uh, then, Chicago. Chicago. And, uh, the other ones. Black Doe siya ta. Si Nosa. Black Doe si Nosa. Si Nosa. A couple of games. What they have in common is all of them were released in 1985. Yes. Yes. What about for this one? What What's that? It's an original pair of Air Jordan 1 and JKO canvas and different to Souls uh, compared with the Jordan 1 85. Why? Why is it different from Souls? This came later. After a year. After a year. After 1986. So, um, sorry, it's a JKO. That's why it's canvas. It's meant to be for a final resemblance of boxing shoes. The AJ, AJ knockout. Oh. And boxer shoes, that? Uh, no? Sa actual fight yeah, yeah. But more on no? the anila, um, inspiration, inspiration behind it. Oh. Mm -hmm. So you have a thicker padding than the normal Jordan ones. Mm -hmm. Saka canvas, no? Tinan canvas, yung fabric, yeah. guys. Oh. Tinan nyo. Oh. Parang converse, no? It's all canvas. It's cheaper. All of it. Except for this, no? Yung swoosh mm -hmm. is swoosh. leather. Saka ito. Itong flap Uppers. leather din. And what about this? What's this? This came out later uh, on the 85, so uh, uh, late, late, late 1985. Just uh, a lower version of uh, Jordan 1s. So that's this, the first one? Th this is the metallic ones. So they actually came up with the retro. Uh -huh. but, so uh, the, that's the very first. Uh, that's the very first low, low top. J1 Low. J1 that's J1 the great grandfather mm -hmm. of the mm -hmm. Travis Scott Low. The hype, the hype. The hype, the hype. The hype, the hype. And they also have that in different colors. Yeah, different colors. But neutral or gray. Neutral gray. Ah. And this one. Um, for the they come out with the you know, mga reds and Chicago. And no, no, or, no. Just uh, gray and white. Metallic. Gray and white. Metallic. One metallic blue, uh -huh. white and metallic blue. Then the other one is white and neutral gray. Uh -huh. for so the where, where do you get all of this? Where is the source of the sneakers? It's uh, mostly some private collectors. Eh. Kasi talang back in the days, walang gusto magbenta. <laughs> Medyo walang gusto magbenta. So, and eBay, doon, meron din before. Pero mostly talaga dati, private collectors yung pinipagunan. Uh -oh. Pero meron pa talaga mga buyers. Yes. Talaga. Yeah. Market, by market. Kaya ka nagpunta ko sa Philippines, ha? Philippines. Or, 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 or. All, all, all across the globe. Oh. In the Philippines, Marinus, we were surprised that when we opened it three weeks ago, we had a lot of interest in the OGO ones. We had a interest in the early release. Unlike the other stories, which are underground. So, we had a lot of interest in the OGO ones. We had a lot of interest in the OGO ones. But it's public. We had a lot of interest in the original games. Give us an idea of how much is this? If I want to buy, for example, I want to buy Chicago, the original 1985 Chicago, how much is it? Um, a dead stock Jordan 1 Chicago with box and original hand tag, mm -hmm. if it's a dead stock mint condition, yeah. it could cost you at least about 5,000 US dollars <laughs> a set. 5,000 US dollars? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, 150,000 or more. Yeah. 250,000 for that? Realistically, yeah. Because if you base it with stock eggs, it's like 7 or 8K US. Oh my gosh. Realistically, about 5. Why would they buy it? Why would they buy an Oceanados? Yeah. Uh, for collection. Serious collectors. Serious collectors. Serious collectors. Yeah, meron talaga mong nag-message sa amin na kumatawag na Sige na, benta mo sa amin to, please lahat na sila ako, takal ko na naghahanap yan So yung mga offers nila, minsan parang out of this world na yung presyo na hindi namin nakala na aabot sa ganong presyo kasi nakuha namin siya years back 
steady market price. Uh -oh. Pero ngayon, nag-shoot up yung prices ng um, Jordan 1s uh, or Jets. What's the highest offer that you got for our sneaker? For the 8.5? Oo, 8.5. Siguro itong used pair ng uh, Black Post na size 6.5. Current offer was 6k US. Which was, which was last month, you know? Last month. And US buyers. Hindi kay po ay ka-isel yun? No, hindi pa kay po pa eh. Kailangan ko magpaalam. Ah, why? Kailangan ko magpaalam. Okay, $6,000 ang offer. Ayaw pa rin nila pumayag. Ano? Bigay nyo na! Sayang naman yung $6,000. No, sorry. That's very hard to find. It's what they call a unicorn pair and it has sentimental value. To uh -oh. me and to my husband. Why? What, what, what's sentimental about well, it? He, it took him a long time to find that pair. And then uh, when he found it, uh, he gave it as a gift to me. Uh -oh. And then he wore it uh, on our prenup in uh, Batangas. Uh -oh. In 2015. In 2015, yes. But he can always buy a new pair for you. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's a special one because he said he took a long time. Girls are sentimental. Oh, sentimental talaga. Oh. Girls. Pero nung time na ni-release to, uh, Mark, how much was it? <laughs> may may tayong box dito. Yeah, Let's unbox box. this one. Okay? Guys, ha, unbox natin to. This is an <laughs> original <Unboxing>. box <laughs> of a uh, one. Okay, ito. O, oh, yan. Original ones, uh, yeah, sila wearable because um, midsole is rubber. Made out of rubber. Compared to sa mga Jordan 2, Jordan 4, they're polyuterine and they um, are crumble okay. sila over time. Mm. So, kaya to, pwede pa yung sotin to, pwede yung pang basketball, pwede yung pang hiking, lahat lang. Hindi pa yung ito. Itong hawak po Sir Julius, uh, it, this is a dead stock pair of uh, Chicago. Uh -huh. Pero yung ibang naka-display natin, uh -huh. may mga pinang basketball kami doon, uh -huh. hindi pumiya. Ang sabi nila, yung, yung shoes daw, through the years, talaga nasisira siya. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, pero, but ito parang is in great condition. Pag tinignan mo, lilinisin mo lang, okay na eh. Yung build ko last talaga si Jordan 1. So, parang it's a good investment kahit yung mga new pairs ng Jordan 1. So, uh, it's built to last. Oh guys, ang actual price niya before, uh, as indicated in the tags uh, box, is $64.99. $64.99. J1 na yan ha. Itong na... Uh, Chicago na to. So how much is it now? Kung po-convert natin? Mga around... Around 3,300 pesos. 3,300 pesos. And now, it's selling for how much? Kung bibili mo yung ganito? Um, you, as mentioned earlier, it's 5,000 US dollar average. Realistic. <laughs> 3,000 uh, plus pesos. Pero sa actual price? 150 plus oh, thousand pesos. 250,000 pesos ang halaga po nito. Grabe. And they even had the, no, no, a sale before, no? Sale. How much was the sale price? Sale price before was $29.88. $29.88? So, makaroon lang yun. One five? One five. One five. One five. One thousand five hundred lang ang Jordan noon. Yung mga original Air Jordan 1, 1985 before. Uh -huh. So, it came with a hand tag. So, yung mga retros na lumabas recently, Walang mga ganito. Oh, wow. So, may hangtag siya. May picture pa rin ni Jumpman. Uh, then, hello. Oh. So, parang ito yung parang pinaka-certificate of authenticity ng sneaker. Something Pang like that. that. Pang -pang. Oh, kasi ito yung mabuji talaga, no? Yeah. Oh, yung mga bago ngayon, wala nang ganito. And, may presyo yan if gusto mong bilhin. Ah. So, so, it matters if it matters. Yeah. The price goes higher with this. Yes, if complete yung set. So, may mga nagbibenta, let's, let's say sa eBay nito, nag-range ng mga $50 to $100 just for the hang tag alone. Additional. Additional. And even the box, may mga nagbibenta ng box only. Actually, may mga nabili kami box dati. Hindi namin alam bakit namin binili, pero nabili namin at $300 just for the OG box. <laughs> Nakaibang mundo ito. Meron din mga copycats no, nung time na yun. Uh, tell us about that, yung mga copycats. So yung copycat, uh, siguro mga late 80s ka. Uh, more intended sa mga... Hindi naman sa walang pera, but they can't afford yun yung price ng Jordan 1. Mahal na yun yung pinag-usapan natin kanina. Yeah, mahal na sa kanila yun. So, may mga ibang company, nag-release na ng mga mock-up pairs. 
that resembles the Jordan one. Uh -huh. so this is a Panther uh -huh. made in Korea. Mm -hmm. So just different swoosh. It's a, uh -huh. They copied the, no, the design. The design. The, the, the one. Uh, usually half the price ang um, ano um, benta oh. back in the day. Mas oh. mayan mga kit kit sizes na replica. Replica na Panther. Oh. Ito yung original. Guys. Yan yung original. Compare natin yung replica. Uh, Magkahawig no, except for the swoosh. Iba yung swoosh. Uh, yung stamping din. ガヤガヤとのそうかガヤガヤパティヨンのののヨンスタンピングのモーレンウィンクスのメロネオえっとヨンシンスジョーダンナイキえっとのマンスパンタルおおペルグルデノいやヨンクオリティーディシャナラレ
Um, range would be about $1,300 to $1,500 mm -hmm. if complete set. Ang maganda rin kasi sa 94, mm -hmm. yung packaging niya. Mm -hmm. So, kakaiba yung box. Mm -hmm. Parang one of the best boxes uh -huh. na nilabas ni Jordan yan. Uh -huh. Then, ito, yung, yung paper niya. Uh -huh. Important ito. And, the oversized retro card. Para may certificate. Oh, para may certificate. Uh -huh. And during that time, how much was it? Ano price na nakalagay dito? Price nung time na yun, uh, price before was $79.99. $79.99? Mas mataas siya ng kaunti, no? Mataas ng $15. Oo, uh -huh. $15. Wow. Sobrang rich talaga ng history na naman, no? For Jordans. Yeah. Grabe. Guys, nasa ano na tayo? Giveaway na tayo. So, if you listen carefully kanina sa ating discussion, ay ang kaya niyong sagutin itong ating mga question. So, the first question is, Gigi, go ahead. Anong year unang nag-release ang Air Jordan 1? Mm -hmm. Next question, Mark. Anong original price ng Jordan 1? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, third question is, uh, saan nag-college si Jordan na naging inspiration ng Off-White Jordan 1? Ayan, answer those questions and we're going to pick five winners. Ano yung mga pakukuha nila dun sa, sa mga winners natin? What will they get? Uh, one will get uh, some cap. Mm -hmm. Some sweatshirt ng Chicago Bulls. Then, dalawang t-shirt ng, ng archive. One all height na t-shirt and one lanyard na archive. Ayan! Ako mag-nagwa-wild na yung mga, mga viewers natin. Post your comments below. Uh, sagutin nyo yung mga questions natin and we're going to random pick the winners. And i-announce natin yung mga winners natin sa mga upcoming vlogs natin. And all you have to do guys, if your name is uh, mentioned, ay uh, pumunta kayo dito sa archive para i-claim nyo yung inyong mga prices. And put your name, the city where you live, and your Instagram and your email account. Again, uh, what is the address of uh, Archive? Archive is located at the ground floor of the Woodridge apartment in McKinley Hill, uh -huh. So you can follow us on Instagram via archive underscore ph and our cafe account via archive underscore cafe. And it's also in Facebook through og underscore archive underscore ph. All right. Thank you so much. We learned a lot today. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Uh, post your comments below and subscribe to Christine Bubbles channel. Oh, you're not forgetting, ah? You're not Julius Bubbles and Clap, but Christine Bubbles, and subscribe, go, kayo, and hit the notification bell para sa mga updates. So from archive, see you soon, guys. Bye.